Five Indian scientists who died mysteriously. Despite all our engineers and doctors, the pure science people, that is, the scientists in India, have always had to face the short end of the stick. It would have been one thing though if the treatment meted out to them was just a lack of funding or incentive. It is quite another thing when their life itself is at stake. Tonight, we tell you about some Indian scientists who died and why we think there is more to their deaths than meets the eye. K.K. Josh and Abhi Shivam Josh was the Chief Engine Room Artificer at the Eastern Naval Command, while Shivam was the Chief Engineer with the INS Arihant. According to the police, they committed suicide. So, why is it suspicious then? The biggest hole in the existing theory is that both their bodies were found on train tracks but had no sign of external injury. This raises the question, how did they die? The most likely explanation is that they were killed by poisoning and then thrown on the tracks. But who indeed would be so meticulous? Lokanathan Mahalingam, senior scientist, Kaiga Atomic Power Station, Karnataka. According to the police, they committed suicide. So, why suspicious? Ten years ago, while he was an employee at the Kalpakam Atomic Plant, Mahalingam had disappeared for five days. When he came back, he claimed he had gone to seek spiritual solace. Could a repeat of this have gone wrong? The guards at the campus did not see him leave either. Also, his decomposed body was found near a river. Did he jump in or was he pushed? No one knows. M. Padmanabhan Ayer, Engineer, Baba Atomic Research Center. According to the police, suicide later declared murder. So why is it suspicious? The police report says that Mr. Ayer was involved in a sex act before his murder. Just because he was gay, how can the possibility of him being caught in a honey trap be discounted? In fact, the proof itself was hampered by the police being unable to get members of the queer community to come on record about the scientists. This shows how discrimination is hurting us. Further, he was a senior researcher at the facility, making his death even more worthy of an investigation. Umang Singh and Partha Pratim Park, researchers, Baba Atomic Research Center, according to the police, burned to death. So why is it suspicious? Both were PhD students, so yes, it doesn't seem right to say they were killed for secrets. The PhD project itself was on free radicals and antioxidant studies. But one thing which was noted was that both of them were not working with any inflammable material in the lab, despite which they died in a fire. They were also the only ones in the lab at that time. Also to be noted, the country's first nuclear installation did not have fire extinguishers in its laboratory. Dalia Nayak, senior researcher, Saha Institute of Nuclear Physics. According to the police, suicide. So why is this suspicious? Her colleagues say that on receiving a call, she rushed home. Later, when a few of them went to check on her, they found her room's door open and saw that Dahlia had consumed poison. Also, as per her colleagues, they had access to even more potent and fast-acting poisons than the one she consumed, mercuric chloride. So why did she choose to kill herself with it? If you still need more convincing, 29 employees of the Department of Atomic Energy died between 2005 to 2010 and 70 employees died between 2008 to 2016.